Hello folks and welcome back to the Vertigo Tea Party and let's play Thief the Dark Project. I can hear a guard walking around. I'm pretty sure he's below me. I just heard him unlock the door. I kind of want to take him out. I want to go downstairs to finish investigating. I don't know if you heard that whistle. I kind of purposely stopped. But there's one whistle which I've always found very creepy. I should try to find an MP3 and make that on my phone. That'd be super fab. The level oh, that's just level two. So we're in pen one. It's actually been about a week since I played. We're gonna stick to the shadows, just like the tutorial told us. How convenient that the shadows crisscross. If you wanna jump jump. How high, real high, it's so supply. We could, we could, we could, we could be back. All right, so I'm gonna check these. I don't expect to find a lot of valuables in a dank prison cell, but you never know. I also need to get 1,000 gold worth of loot before I leave, which again probably isn't going to be an issue. Guys to the left. Oh shit! I don't remember how to. Okay, there's how you lean forward. I need to change that. That's very bizarre. Shit. Okay, sorry. I heard that and I thought. Okay. Can I not open that door? Okay. Oh, is this one of the ones that's got the. Okay. I think it's. The, I think the lock. Mechanisms on the other side. Yeah, I heard a door open. Okay, careful. Again, I really. Sorry, I'm trying to be very quiet at times because I. The foundation is weak. You wail and gnash your teeth. You ask it to repair itself. Nay, you tear it down and begin anew. So shall it be with all my children, whether they be stone or flesh. Okay, that guy sounded pretty close. Oh, I need the key. Vigilance is our shield that protects us from the squalid past. Knowledge is our weapon with which we carve a path to an enlightened future. All right, I really want to knock this guy out. I All right, so he saw me. They have pretty damn good peripheral vision. So what we're gonna do is find our keys. Vigilance is our shield. We're going to shoot an arrow over here. At the no wait. Who is that? Whoa! Some serious lag is what that was. Whoa! Okay, I... Ah, shit. Somebody must have found a body. Well, that's unfortunate. I don't know if the alarm ever goes off. I will have to watch my ass, though, because now they're alerted. So, yeah, somebody must have found a body. Which, that's one reason you need to be careful. Because some guards have very long paths. Because I really... Don't think it was him. Again, we have to listen. Look around those corners. See, I love this. I hate in other games where you actually have a mini map. Well, I don't hate it, but I just find them a little easier. But easier to commentate, though, because you don't have to focus so much. So the alarm either went off or we're out of range. There's a guard up there again. We're in block two. And just as a quick refresher on our goals. Uh, let's see. The ones we need to get. The main one is to release Cuddy. Uh, we need to also release Basso the Box Man, which was one of our hi uh, hard level quests. Uh, we need a thousand gold. And we need to, then we need to escape with both Cuddy and Basso. And we cannot kill anyone. Okay. 
these damn stones. Why couldn't you put carpet everywhere? Okay, I don't think I can open that door. I think this is the same as that other area. Let's get to this before we try it. Okay. Nope. I am going to try to get better about... We're going to move slowly because I see a guard over there. I am going to try to get better about saving off camera because I kept... When I went back to edit out all the saves before, I realized half the time I was, if not more, was talking during the save. Got a... In front of me? Yeah, this is definitely a good game to have a headset. Because it is very important to hear where sounds are coming from. As you may imagine, I want to pop this open. Get up here quickly. Ah, shit. Keep forgetting. I need to move my item scrolling keys on the keyboard. Okay. All right, it's fine. It's fine. Okay, that guard is in that way. Okay, I think we can be out of his peripheral. All right, he's got his back turned. Ooh. Hello. It's kind of funny that he does that, turning his back, because there's really nothing there. In fact, I don't think he's supposed to turn. Hearken to the designs the Builder has made, and keep his statutes. Thou wilt share in his triumphs. Okay. It's like you got just to hear what they say. I find the dialogue interesting. The builder said. What the Builder say? The builder said, you about to get effed up, son? Well, not out. <sighs> Damn it. Come on. Turn around. Don't turn around. Actually, I do want you to turn around. God damn it. And the builders, <laughs> you dick. The foundation is weak. You wail and gnash your teeth. You ask, do my eyes show me her right? <laughs> yeah, he still heard me. I don't know how they're seeing and hearing me. Sometimes. Now, again, you... <laughs> Let's not push that button. We learned that lesson the hard way before. Sometimes you don't want to just throw over all the cages because there'll be zombies and shit in there. So, yeah, be careful with that. Let's check the ledger. Damn it, come on. Cell block two. Vandal, Potsol, fingers crushed, ouchie. Thief, Gelland, wrist broken. Name, Jackablade, blogging. Died neath righteous punishment. Ah, <laughs> uh, fuck it, open them all. Remember that thing I just said about not opening them all? See, somebody just ran out. I don't know who the hell that was, though. Hopefully, it does not backfire. I mean, what what are the chances of that while I'm recording? Very high, actually. Mostly, I'm opening them to... to look inside, but again probably not going to be a lot interested. So the ones that are closed, I don't have to worry about because they were open before. At least I think. Anyway, somebody had asked in the comments if they, they said they like stealth games. They asked if they should play this one. And I would say absolutely. Again, even watching me play and I feel this way about most games but just watching me or anyone else play isn't the same as playing because you come up with your own strategies you attack these situations in your own way. So it's the actual playing of the game. You're just seeing my version of it. So I would, if you like stealth games, I would su suggest it. Also, I do apologize about the flashing at the bottom left. I don't know if you heard me mention it before, like the health, little health shields flash. I apologize, there's nothing I can do about it. As far as I know, it was 
kind of a pain in the ass just to get this to record properly. Because it is such an old, so fantastic game. All right. I need to figure out. We are done with cells two and one. We need to get back to the intersection so we can check out four. I don't know why I was walking back and forth like an idiot. Oh, shit. Nope, that alarm's still going. I don't know where they found the body. But I think we might. It's two and four. Let's check our map. Uh, da -da. Uh, okay, that doesn't really help. We're going to have to be really careful here. Even though I think I knocked all these guys out anyway. But it might have pulled other guards over, so. Just listening for footsteps. And again, any saving screens, I apologize. I'm trying to cut most of them out. I'm definitely going to run into more guards here. We haven't had to use water arrows much. So let's go ahead and put this out. Ooh. Guard, pretty damn close. Okay, this is a similar room that we saw before. Ooh, what's this? Goodies? <clears throat> Ooh, there well. Guard sounds very close. A light that I can't put out. All right, this might be a bastard. Not the person. I mean, I don't have any idea of what his lineage is. <coughs> okay, I saved it. I'm gonna try to lean forward and knock his ass out. Damn it. All right, it's duck. Oh shit, that was wrong. Ha <laughs> <laughs> ha! Awesome. Now let's get him inside. Let's see. Better yet. Stick him... <laughs> Back here, where the alarm is anyway. Put it... Well, you know what? Let's put him a little further. Putting where that other guy is because if they find one body, they might as well find both, right? Does that make sense? Like, if you have five guards to put away, it's much better to put them all in one spot because there's only one chance that they'll find the guards. It's not like the alarm gets worse the more guards they find. Does that makes sense. So you should put them all in one spot. I don't see a rational reason not to. Damn it. What the hell? I have no idea why the alarm keeps going off. Like, this one's going off now. Yeah, I don't quite get that. I wonder if those guys have to be there or the alarm goes off automatically, which doesn't make a lot of sense. Oh, well. We'll ignore it. Very bizarre. It seems... I don't know, it just makes sense. I don't know why it would go off. There's really no guards to find bodies. I mean, because the alarm over there is going off, not the alarm here. And it both times it happened very shortly after I knocked that guard out. So I don't understand. Anyway, this is going to be the same setup. Which makes sense. Here, it's a little hard. Shit. Where is he? Above me, I think. All right, he's going that way. Okay, that freaked me out because I thought he was coming through that door, and he still might. It's hard to tell which way that guy's facing. Okay, I'm pretty sure he's looking this way. Come on, okay. Didn't think I was going to be able to do that. It okay, doesn't look like there's anybody in cell two. Or one. Oh, there's a guard. Hmm. 
do I risk following him and knocking him out? I think that would be unwise because the guy just turned around to you. You gonna go through that door? Okay, good. I wanna know his pattern. We can just hang out. There's a dead guy. There's a living person. Or are they alive? It's, yeah, it looks, they look pretty living. Alright, right, and we had to be careful because that guard came through here. So, I think what we're going to do is actually wait here. We're going to wait for him to come back and pop him when he does. Is there a better spot for it? No, I was thinking maybe I could stand in a hall to the side, but it's it's too he'd be way too close. Even if pitch black, he would probably be able to see me. But if I do it quickly here, I should be able to knock him out. And the guy above should not hear. Blackjack should be a 100% silent method. Oh yeah, I think now I think about it, I think one of the things I said I was going to do is change my lean forward key. Oh, he might be coming this way. Which would be helpful, actually. Room is people I have to work with, so incompetent, so stupid, so lazy. I don't see why I should be the one to be put with these incompetent people. <laughs> Need my stapler. Somebody took my stapler. No, he's coming this way. All right, and you can actually lift your blackjack up. And prepare it to drop. That, believe it or not, can be quite handy. Oops, easy. Damn it! My, okay, and probably should not have done this. I not knocked the guard out. Uh, I kind of want to put him in that cell, but I think that would be unwise. I, uh, but I was what I was complaining about was just leave him right here was that my phone I changed my alerts for email to sound like the you've been detected sound from Metal Gear <laughs> so like it just happened to go off right as I picked that guard up I was like oh shit I've been spotted I've got to get in the cardboard box oh I didn't realize it's playing again because I'm in the light I don't 100% understand how the how the linear mechanic works as far as detection goes. What the hell? Hmm. I don't want to bring that guy there. Back. I may do that now. Sorry, I keep poking down there seeing what it is. Alright. This guy up. Put him in that random room. Shouldn't be able to see me here right now. Okay, close the dough. All right, sneak up on this guy. And of course, as I say that, he turns back around. Don't turn around. Identify thyself. Damn it. Is someone there? Oh, hey. That Chicky. The wind, then. the wind sounds just like footsteps. I don't think he saw me. I think he heard me. Go, go. Okay. That was a little tight. You know what I mean? Ah, uh, who are you? Oh, that's just the peasant talking, not the guard. Damn it. Let's get this guy. Look there. He's got a bow. Calm down over there. I almost pressed that damn button again. Hey, right, let's put you. Damn it. I hate having to use this key to get in and out. Damn it! Over here! Shut up. Save me! See, that is. <laughs> A slight issue is that they ha use kind of the same 
AI for everything. Like, why is that guy, he saw me, and he's just running against the cell. I think he probably assumed worse. Being a prisoner of, uh, Cragscliff. 